Welcome to this edition of Open SCAD by DIY3DTech.com. In this episode, we're going to be taking a look at uh, just just a quickie here at creating this object. Uh, in short, it's a K cup, and uh, for a Keurig coffee maker. So one of the things watching Chuck Hellebuck's channel um, sort of was inspired to kind of do something with this RD Works Learning Labbers. Um, I forget the actual name of his channel. He does a lot with lasers. He actually did something like this too with the um, Nepresso or something like that, uh, the European version of the, the pods, which was interesting, and in laser cut it out. So one of the things I wanted to do was sort of experiment with a couple things. However, to do that, what I needed is, is the base uh, cartridge model. So I could add that in and then obviously use this as a difference because one of the things, as you can see here, is the taper on this um, cylinder and one of the nice parts about uh, open SCAD is again it's very easy to taper the cylinder so what I did is actually match that taper uh, used a set of calibers measured out the uh, pod itself so we have the long body of the pod we have a top lip and then we have uh, or top collar I should say and then we actually have a lip up here that uh, is what keeps it from falling into the machine. So I wanted to represent all those so when I when I create my models I can just do a difference of this module and I can replicate this module as many times as I want and, and we'll I'll actually do some upcoming videos. Uh, you know, however if you're thinking about making something for K-Cup I wanted to you know throw this model out there and kind of show how it works. Now I really didn't um, look at, at chamfering the the edges of this because I don't really think that's important and that'd be I think a whole lot of work for not very much value you know because the the modules themselves seem to be um, vacuum formed or whatever out of a thin polyethylene or polypropylene or something plastic and and with that the, all the corners have have a camphor to it because obviously it, it's probably um, either pressed or vacuum formed around a mold that has similar camferings. So anyways, um, the biggest thing is I wanted to do here is get the get the taper of the body that you see in the middle here and then as well as get the the collar and lip designs so with those in place pretty much you can deal with just about anything in a 3d or 2.5d modeling world with this and so it's just kind of a quick and dirty I am going to while I'm thinking about it I do want to bump up the um, I do want to go up higher on this this is not um, some purists might complain, but I want to see a little bit cleaner line on this. So, yeah, there we go. We pop, popped it up to 100. That looks a little bit better. So this is how I'm going to save the code and put it out there. So if you're looking for doing something with a K-cup and looking for a quick module, instead of having to, you know, measure it all out yourself, you know, feel free to ste steal this and use it as you see fit. Again, if you found this interesting, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and cheers. We'll see you in the next